Mm. My husband, Gunther von Hagens, he is the inventor of the technology called plastination. Body World is a unique opportunity for everyone to really understand and see firsthand what you are made of. How all organs are located inside our body, how the muscles work, how the nerves uh, are emanating from the spinal cord, reaching out to the fingertips and toes. And that is really a great, great opportunity that you shouldn't miss. We've been aware that the Body World exhibitions have been on display throughout many major cities uh, throughout the world and I thought, oh, wouldn't it be wonderful if we could manage to get something like this to Newcastle. Here it is and wow, isn't it wonderful? It's an amazing chance to find out who you are. This is an exhibition that's about us, it's about humans, it's about the human body. It's a chance to see inside, see your organs, see your muscles, see them actually in action. Because of the way the plastinates are mounted, you can see how our body moves when it is in motion. You can examine it really closely. I don't think that there's a better way of teaching people about what lies beneath their skin than, than the human body itself, than a cadaver. You don't want them presented in a way that they would be in a medical school. We are about um, communicating science of all kinds, and this really is very deep science communicating in a very accessible way. It ties in really well with all the research um, activities that go on on site. So it's going to have a really wide ranging, deep and positive effect. It's a fusion, I suppose, is the best way of describing it as, you know, art and science. Um, so it shows the creativity of science as well, I think, which is incredibly important. It's not a textbook. It's real, isn't it? It's big. It's, it's real life. You can see that that's actually a person and it's not flat on a page and it's, you can walk around it and have a look at the back and the front and the sides. It's not like any other exhibitions that you see where it's stuck against a wall. I'm blown away by it, I really am. It just opens up a different dimension to what you normally do. We look at people in neat packages and this just opens up another dimension, I think, to life. So, thumbs up from me. When you get to see this with your real eyes, I think it does make you realise, wow, this is all going inside my body. Like, you just make you appreciate how, like, how great we are, really. I thought it would just be like, poses around but yeah. not like this like when it shows you all the insides and how the in where the heart is and everything the smaller pieces tend to show the pathologies so the shrunken kidneys and and the emphysema of the lungs and things those those are the smaller um, showcases but they, they're really interesting they tell a whole different story to what the the whole body plastinates do we found the lungs very interesting how the smokers yeah. and the emphysema it's good to see what smoking actually does to, to a pair of lungs. This exhibition is really well done. It completely avoids that sort of ghoulish macabre. It's a really, really deeply moving, interesting insight into um, the human body and who we are. And it's really moving and profound. I love it. Plastination technology does not only the specimen dry and odorless and durable, it is also hardening the body so that soft tissue can take over holding function. So in this way we can show the entire muscle system standing upright, otherwise it would collapse. I was interested about the fact how they got them to bend over backwards and the guitar wasn't like weighing them down, so that was pretty cool. Centre for Life offers us a great deal of things as teachers, things that we can't do in the lab. We would never ever experience something like this with a group of children. You can tie this in with the anatomy and physiology lab sessions that they have upstairs and then incorporate a general visit to the Centre for Life as well. And they'll remember something like this forever really. This moving emotional experience is really motivating people to at least rethink their lifestyles and that is our utmost goal to really help people towards a healthy and vital life. 
I think it will give people of the North East an opportunity to see themselves as they've never seen themselves before. And I hope that they take away a sense of wonder and awe at the marvel that is the human body. I think this particular museum works absolutely great with uh, the exhibit and the idea of body works. I couldn't think of a better place and I'm absolutely sure it will be of great success here in Newcastle as well.